Well, people in Elizabeth City are telling us their utility bills have gone up, in some cases, higher than what they pay for rent. Investigative reporter Chris Horn shows us why the rate for electricity is not the main factor. The residents here have a combined utilities bill, so their water, electricity, and other items are all in the same statement. And the electric rate is the same as it was last year. They're way too high. They're way too high. It was okay at first, and then now all of a sudden it just shot up. So we're just trying to hope and pray that they go down. That's how Elizabeth City residents are describing their utility bills lately. Stacy Childress just paid $540 at the drive through window. Oh, it's rough. It's, you have to choose what you pay first. Others have told us they're paying more for utilities than they do for rent. The utility bills combine electric, water, sewer, and trash usage. New city manager Montre Freeman says a combination of factors are in play. The water rate went up at the same time the mercury went down. We've had some really cold and wet days, and so consequently, I'm sure everyone has used more energy. Plus, the city has switched to new, more accurate smart meters, and Freeman says his bill went up too. It's a lot more accurate than just uh, shooting a gun and reading a meter in that fashion. Since they put them new meters in, mm -hmm. I think that's what made them go up some. The new meters enable residents to see how they're using energy, adjust their usage, and ultimately save money. Some residents told us they believe the bills are higher to make up for lost revenue when people couldn't pay their utilities bill during the pandemic. But the city manager here says that is not the case. In Elizabeth City, Chris Horn, 10 on your side.